Hello everyone, the PR and Branding Committee brings to you a brand new episode of Simpson Radio. I, Pulkit Gupta and I, Vedika Pandey welcome you all to another episode of our series, Events Sneak Peek. In this series, we will be glimpsing behind the scenes which nobody has access to, sharing the gossip which everyone enjoys and extracting every bit of information from a responsible and fun guest who would be an integral part of the core team. In this episode, we will be featuring Akash Bhagavia, co-chairperson of MarkWest, the flagship event of Integrated Marketing Communications. Hi, Akash. Hi, Pankit. Hi, Vedika. We also have in our panel Vishal Nambiar, the sponsorship head, core team of ICON, which is the flagship event of Master of Computer Applications. Welcome, Vishal. Hi, Vedika. Hi, Pulkit. It's good to be here. Now, let's start with the questions. So, tell us something about your committee and its flagship event. All right. So, uh, Marquess is the only annual peaceful marketing communications festival of Mumbai. This is a two-day flagship event organized by the Mansion students of the Integrated Marketing Communication Program. Our event is basically aimed to flourish in various avenues of marketing communications through its unique and creative events. These include competitions, workshops, and industry interactions with top experts. Telling about ICON, ICON is a flagship event of MCA and we aim here to bring in technical as well as non-technical flagship uh, non-technical events for all the aspirants of institute and other institute. Uh, we have three days event, uh, one consisting of hackathon, uh, first day of hackathon and two days of the both technical and non-technical and some gaming events which, we, which is all time fun. Yeah. Wow, that is so interesting to know. Now moving on to the next question. What are the different programs that will be conducted under the main flagship event? So, amongst the span of this two-day festival, there will be three events, which are Case Quest, a main flagship case study competition, Afkibar, the simulation of a political PR campaign, giving the participants the opportunity to work as a political strategist. And then lastly, we have AdMat, the advertising competition, which aims to test your creativity to the limit as you present an advertising campaign. Apart from the events, we even have a panel discussion wherein industry stalwarts share their knowledge and experience with the attendees and participants. Uh, talking about ICON, ICON has uh, day one uh, with Hackathon and Hackathon is a big event uh, and then the day two consists of uh, events which are technical as well as non-technical. Technical as in uh, we have uh, events which includes coding and uh, other fun games related to programming and a uh, very technical side and then talking about non-technical we have fun games like uh, presentation royal and other games which are uh, which other people and common people or non-technical people can play and then the uh, and then along with this too we have some gaming events like which everyone is very much eager to do that is uh, CSGO, Valorant, etc. etc. Wow, all this information is already making me so excited for the events. I'm sure our audience will be so grateful to know all this. Now, I think we've had enough of the, all the weighty committee talk and it's time to go a little candid. So, what does immediately come to your mind when we mention the most fun and the most hectic part of organizing the event? Okay, so talking about the most fun part, I personally believe would be actually witnessing the amount of creativity that is showcased during our events by the participants. One can be a witness to the incredible valuable insights and the priceless knowledge they bring to the table. And talking about the most hectic part, um, well, I will believe that would actually be after your presentations when the panel asks you questions as making you extremely impromptu in your response and keeping you on your toes. Uh, the fun part will be working along with the team and watching participants do uh, participate in the events and do all those creative stuff like uh, I said. Yeah, the most hectic part will be uh, managing everything uh, in the event and uh, yeah, that will be the most hectic part, nothing else. That was really fun to know. So moving on, as you guys are part of the organizing core team, what can a person learn by attending such events? 
by being a part of the organizing team one can learn a lot about management skills and more importantly along with that you also get to work with your classmates which further fuels a bond and unity with your friends and by becoming a participant in one of our events one will have the immense opportunity to learn a lot about marketing from industry experts since each one of our events not only aims to push your creativity but the valuable feedback <clears throat> provided by our judges is a very unique learning experience for the participants so uh, what i got to learn from icon is uh, apart from all the curriculums and all the academics we have uh, i got to learn how to approach a company how to deal with stuff and uh, i guess everyone will agree to this that uh, we get to learn the team spirit or the team playing thing we have in us from uh, working in a team or a committee that is something i got to learn and everybody will like to be agree to uh guys can you tell me again when are the registration starting because i am definitely coming to these events for sure now moving on and our last question of the day can you shed some light on the list of dignitaries uh, the chief guest who will be attending the flagship events so we don't have any chief guests as such but we will be witnessing the presence of a lot of experts from the marketing industry who will share their insights and learnings from the experience in the industry uh we'll be calling some alums uh the one uh, being mr hariharan uh and uh, we have uh, as i mentioned there is a big event called hackathon which has a huge cash prize and uh, which is completely coding based so we have three more alums uh, who are going to be uh, designing problem statements and will be there throughout uh, mr srinivasan subramanyam advait joshi and firoz wadia these are the people who will be there uh, along with uh, our own professor sudarshan uh, sir uh, and uh, this people will be there to witness hackathon and uh, give the cash prize and organize this hackathon event and yeah that's the update till now i am pretty sure it would be so insight insightful to learn from these key opinion leaders and now comes the part which we don't like but have to follow the concluding statements Thank you so much Akash and Vishal for taking out time and being a part of this episode. On the behalf of the entire committee, we would like to wish you all the best for your upcoming signature events. Yeah, uh, thank you guys. It's a pleasure being here. Thank you Pulkit, thank you Vedika for bringing me here. Thank you so much. Thank you. It was so wonderful to have you guys here conversing with us and I'm sure that after this episode we'll have our audiences running to register themselves to be a part of your committee events. So this is it from us for now but we'll be back with numerous fun episodes. Stay tuned for more only on Simser Radio. <laughs>